just listened to President Biden where he was addressing a crowd here in the Capitol about Holocaust Remembrance Day. And he brought up the issue of anti-Semitism on the campuses. And as a student, Julia, could you address that? I was so alarmed by Biden's speech for so many reasons. He used it as a political opportunity to justify the ongoing genocide in Gaza. And not once did he mention Gaza. Not once did he mention the genocide that we're watching unfold in real time. But to speak also about the encampments, I mean, he spoke of violence and destruction of property and tried to purport these lies, which are, is not the reality of what's going on. We see students protesting against genocide, risking their finals, risking suspension, coming together and creating spaces that support one another. That To do that on this day, in that space, an event about Holocaust remembrance, was so disgraceful um, and I think undermines the entire reason that we have this event again, which is never again. And he, I want to just add, opened his speech saying never again means never forget. Um, and then somehow forgot that Gaza is happening. My mother escaped the Holocaust and Holocaust Day is in my DNA. It's a great meaning and great sadness to me. But Biden used it in a weaponized way. Instead of incorporating the world and healing and identifying that there is now another genocide, lest we forget what Israel is doing as is a genocide, instead of doing that, he narrowed it to a point of saying it's all about the anti-Semitism. It debases the idea of anti-Semitism and it debases the idea of the Holocaust. Can we say, as Jews, never again right now means stop the genocide? Gaza 